Hello there, everybody. Maya here today, and today I wanted to talk a little bit about, um, yeah, I want to talk a little bit about the future of this series, Mythcraft. Nope, it's not going away. In fact, we are going to be doing a lot more of it. We're going to be doing a lot more with Mythcraft, and what I mean by that is that we're going to see Season 3 coming soon. I have a new logo and everything I've been working on. Um, I have a lot of ideas for the future of this series and what I want to do basically uh, is, is do a lot more with uh, the different mod packs um, especially from the Technic launcher I've been playing with that a, a lot recently and I really really have enjoyed what I've done in uh, Hexit and Techit and looking at all the other different mod packs and stuff like that I wanted to play around with. So that's going to be in the future. Uh, I want to do a Feed the Beast Unleashed series. So basically what you're going to see uh, for Season 3, it's not going to say Season 3, there's just going to be three different like themed uh, series. series -es. Uh, there's going to be the um, it's going to be Minecraft Tech It, and that's going to be a pretty interesting series. Um, it's going to be really based around um, an explorer kind of idea I had. Um, the other one is the Minecraft Hexit series. That's the other thing I wanted to uh, explore. That's going to be like an adventurer kind of series. Uh, let's see, the last one is Mythcraft Feed the Beast Unleashed. And I think I'll just call it, you know, Mythcraft Unleashed or something. And that will be the other... It'll sort of be like three separate kind of series. But it's all Minecraft related. Um, that's the first thing I wanted to talk about. The second thing I wanted to talk about is Minecon. I didn't even get a chance to talk about Minecon. That was like a couple weeks ago. And I really wanted to talk about Minecon. I had fun. I got to do a lot of, uh, I got to check out a lot of the booths, a lot of the, the mods and games and server hosts and all kinds of other stuff at Minecon. I got to meet a few of the Minecrackers and I got to meet Zuljin, who I follow. I follow his channel. And, uh, you got some signatures from some people, and I was, I mean, I would rather, you know, stop and talk to these people, but they're kind of busy, they're doing a lot of signaturing, and that sort of thing, so I, I didn't get to really talk to them that much. I, I think I saw Zuljin more than once, so that was pretty cool. He actually recognized me the second time, so I was kind of surprised, I was like, hey, yeah, you, okay, cool, you, you know who I am. And, um, I was kind of happy about that. I've been uh, following uh, his series for quite some time, and Hypermine and Cobblestone Chronicles and all that. So I was I was really happy to uh, finally meet a lot of these people in person, especially Zisto. I, I did not know what Zisto looked like, and, um, and now I do. And I got a picture taken with him, and I think I got my picture taken with Doc M. Um, I got my picture taken with, uh, Zuljin. So, I, I got a lot of pictures with people at Minecon. <laughs> uh, another funny thing is I, um, I went to the Origin booth, and I knew that Origin kind of has Swifty as their, uh, you know, their sponsor. Or he does a lot of stuff with them, and Razor was at that booth. So, I was like, hey, <laughs> will Swifty be here? And they were like, yeah. Well, he didn't actually show up at, at the first day of Minecon. He was at the second day of Minecon. But he he did go to the um, Islands of Adventure. And we were actually in line behind Swifty and Haunted um, for the Harry Potter ride, which we probably shouldn't have got on. I... Yeah, Purple has, you know, issues. Um, and I have, I don't, I don't think I have balance issues or, you know, motion sickness or anything, but dang, that ride kind of like, I got off that thing and I couldn't stand up straight. I was like, okay, I'm just going to hug this wall. 
I don't think it would have made me sick. I think it would have just made me like, you know, dizzy slightly. Because it kind of throws you around a lot. It's really, I wouldn't say it's a violent ride, but it's pretty, pretty strong. And there's a lot of screens that make it look like you're flying and stuff. It's really cool. So I had fun at, I had fun at Islands of Adventure. That was probably like one of the few things that we got to do there is ride that ride. Uh, just walked around, looked at everything. I think the uh, the second day of Minecon was actually pretty cool too. We got to you know look at all the booths and <laughs> grab a bunch of swag, um, take it home with us. I got like we got one of those tre uh, chests that look like a re uh, like a Minecraft chest and stuff. Got a bunch of shirts. We got I got the three we got the three Creeper Moon shirt. You know. So we basically, you know, we enjoyed ourselves at Minecon pretty much. It was fun. And as you can see, I haven't really built anything in this world since since the last time. Um, hmm, not really much going on here. So yeah, okay, so expect three new series for Series 3, which that's going to be crazy and also kind of fun. I'm looking forward to um, making... A lot of content with Minecraft. I want to do more like, you know, World of Warcraft, the other stuff like that. I think uh, I've got a lot of stuff to do, really, for all that. So this video I'm basically making to say, hey look, I'm still here. I've been busy learning. I've been learning Feed the Beast, Unleashed, and uh, I've been learning Hexit and Techit. And I know it's more fun to be like, I don't know what to do, but it's also kind of useful to be able to say this is how you make this or today's goal is we're going to do this and that's what I really wanted to do with the, those series instead of just puttering around like I have been in Minecraft lately so the past couple days I haven't been you know doing anything I wanted to I, this whole week I wanted to do stuff with Doctor Who I wanted to do some Gary's Mod Doctor Who stuff I have Ah, so much stuff to do, but um, I've also been pretty busy socially and just other stuff. I do, I do volunteering and... Oh, that's the other thing. I was at, at my volunteer job at uh, a museum here in Florida. And I'm not going to say which one, but if, you know, you probably know which one I'm talking about. But I was actually volunteering and I, I do the thing where they do the audio tour and people bring their audio tours back and we hand them out there and I I saw that these people you know you have to give your license to get the audio tour so these people came back to you know give back their audio uh, tour thing hello chicken and so I looked at their license and I was like oh that looks you know vaguely uh, Scandinavian in origin the the words on it so I was like where is that from and they're like oh that's Sweden and I, and, and I had just come back from Minecon, so I was like, oh, Sweden, yeah, I, uh, I just came back from Minecon. And I look up at the guy, and he's wearing the the the, the t-shirt for the, the space game that Notch was designing. And I'm like, oh! <laughs> Suddenly I realized, uh, wait a second, you, of course you know what Minecon is. He's like, yeah, I'm Grum. And I'm like, oh, okay, that's who you are. So, yeah, apparently uh, the, they were still hanging around uh, Florida, and one of them was at our museum. So that was kind of cool. Uh, basically, I had fun at Minecon. I, I know that um, I, I wanted, you know, to do that, and I'm very grateful that me and Purple got to do that. That was actually pretty awesome. And uh, Minecon was awesome. And everyone who was at Minecon was really friendly and really good. And basically, a good time was had by all, I hope. And no one got, um, we didn't get sick from Minecon or anything like you normally would do for a convention. So, everything was good. Uh, then we came home, and the next week we watched BlizzCon on the virtual ticket. And, you know, so... It was actually kind of funny because a lot of the people, there were very few people that from from uh, Minecon that were actually at BlizzCon, and I think Swifty was at both. The people from Curse were at both, so they were kind of busy. 
uh, the people from Jinx were probably at both, because I know that they had booths, booths, booths at both of those events. So those people work really hard, and um, they have some pretty cool T-shirts too. Yeah. So, um, hmm. What else do I talk about other than a new series and Minecon and uh, meeting a uh, Mojangster? Uh, not really, not really much. Uh, I know that I want to, um, do more with Minecraft series. But, for now, this particular world you won't be seeing much of. You're going to be seeing some interesting content to come. Uh, you might see this world occasionally. I might pop back in here and work on something. But, I think, for now, I want to... Since they're not really updating the Minecraft pack anymore, and that's what, you, what this world is based off of, I wanted to just do something a little bit more fresh, and uh, a little bit interesting, and maybe some more adventure-type uh, modes of uh, Minecraft. So, this series will still be here. Uh, but for now, it's just going to be like... It's going to take a little break. You will not see this particular world that often. As much as you will those those new uh, series. So enjoy my little you know run through of the skyscraper here. But for now, I'll be signing off, and you will see more Minecraft content very soon. And I, I think what I will do to end this video, I want to see. There we go. Let's go to the roof. So, I should be wearing high jump boots, okay, or long fall boots, or whatever they're called. The don't get hurt when you jump a long distance boots. Alright, so, ladies and gentlemen, I appreciate you watching this video and taking time out of your day. I hope you subscribe, I hope you like the video, I hope you favorite the video, I hope you watch more of my Minecraft content in the future. And I would definitely go back and watch the rest of Season 2. Um, it kind of developed the way it developed. And Season 3 will be three different series. I'm just going to underline that right there again. And for now, I hope that you have a good day. And I hope that everything goes well in your Minecraft world. And for now, let us jump. Hopefully we actually fall into the hole. Yay! We actually fell into the hole that time. Cool. Alright, so take take it easy, people. And, um, in the future, we will see you.